Today's medical-centric topic is What is Parental Alienation Syndrome? Parental Alienation Syndrome, PAS, is a controversial term used to describe a situation where one parent is actively working to turn their child against the other parent. This behavior can be intentional or unintentional, but the end result is a child who has developed a negative attitude towards one of their parents. PAS is a term that was first coined in the 1980s by psychiatrist Richard Gardner. Gardner believed that PAS was a specific form of child abuse that was being perpetrated by one parent against the other. He identified a set of symptoms that he believed were indicative of PAS, including a child's unexplained hatred or fear of one parent, the child's adoption of the alienating parent's beliefs about the other parent, Despite its controversial nature, many mental health professionals recognize PAS as a real phenomenon. They acknowledge that some parents do engage in behaviors that can lead a child being alienated from the other parent, and that this can have serious negative consequences for the child's emotional well-being. There are many factors that can contribute to the development of PAS. Some common ones include a history of conflict or abuse between the parents, a high-conflict divorce, and a parent who is struggling with their own mental health issues. The effects of PAS on children can be severe. Children who are alienated from one of their parents may experience anxiety, depression, and feelings of low self-worth. They may also struggle with relationships later in life, as they have not had a healthy model for how to maintain healthy relationships. If you suspect that your child is being subjected to PAS, it's important to take action as soon as possible. This may involve seeking the help of a mental health professional who is experienced in dealing with these types of situations. In some cases, it may be necessary to seek legal intervention to ensure that the child's best interests are being met. To prevent PAS from occurring, it's important for both parents to work together to maintain a positive relationship with their child. This means avoiding negative talk about the other parent, respecting each other's parenting styles, and prioritizing the child's emotional well-being above all else. In conclusion, parental alienation syndrome is a controversial but recognized phenomenon that can have serious negative consequences for children. If you suspect that your child is being alienated from you by your ex-partner, it's important to take action to address the situation as soon as possible. Working together as co-parents to maintain a positive relationship with your child is key to preventing PAS from occurring in the first place. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.